You were close on one. I was close on a few, but every did time you, I get... Did it turn you over and dive the nose? Yeah, every time I get to that point, there's just so many people. Yeah. And I just, I, I don't know how to maneuver around yeah. them on the way. If you couldn't get on my stuff. You guys are like coming from like internationally, so yeah. like all over. Panel. They're real good. I mean, most of them are getting up yeah, and they're there. They oh, 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 oh. How did they not run over? I don't know. <laughs> It was it was good. Yeah. I felt kind of intimidated because everybody there, like people travel from all over the world to surf there. So there's a lot of professional surfers there that can just, you know, paddle in a little bit and they're going. But it was it was a little difficult for me because I'm not a professional surfer by any means. Oh, give the boy a kite. Yeah. Then <laughs> that's it. Speaking of surfing, there is another kind of surfing that is not difficult at all when you have Surfshark VPN. Now remember guys, we don't promote products that we don't use and love and we do love our Surfshark VPN. We have it turned on all the time on the boat so that we can access Paramount Plus and Hulu and TV shows and movies that are otherwise restricted in the countries that we're in. So Jack can hop onto Netflix now and he can watch all the surfing movies that he wants and try to get better at riding those waves. I absolutely hate the cookie consent pop-ups that come up and you're forced to accept or deny or reject. So Surfshark has a feature where you can just turn that off so you can get on with your business. It's available on Chrome and Firefox. And so that is an awesome thing about Surfshark. Another thing I love about Surfshark is their customer service. It's available 24 seven via email or chat. I love the chat feature when it comes to any customer service because you can just do your business right there. You don't have to spend time on the phone on hold forever. So sign up now using my link, surfshark.deals forward slash Satara, and you'll get six months free. With Christmas right around the corner, you can turn on Surfshark and eliminate price discrimination. And so you'll get the best deals on those holiday items. Again, surfshark.deals forward slash Satara, and the link is also in the description. I love you. <laughs> so a few months ago I did an episode on the cost of fuel and how much money we had spent on fuel so far this year, uh, cruising the med and such, and um, it was uh, actually it was three or four months ago and we were up at $10,000. And by the time you're watching this episode, the year will almost be over and we're filling up again. We've spent $16,000 so far. Today we'll probably spend $1,000. We'll probably fill up right before we go across the Atlantic. Today is November 21st, and so we'll probably fill up one more time. So I'm thinking about $18,000 total for fuel for the year, and that is really expensive. A lot of the fuel was uh, was expensive. It was in the med. Just so you know, I know you guys like to hear about costs and, and what it costs to sail and fill up and stuff and motor as much as we do because we don't sail as much as we should. We just like to get to where we're going. And if that means paying a little more for fuel, then so be it. Um, we get to where we're going and we can spend time in the water playing and doing things we love instead of sailing and tacking back and forth. So 
anyway, we're getting fuel and uh, then we're gonna do something else. I don't know what. What are we gonna do? I don't know. We're gonna get fuel and I don't know. Are we going back out to anchor? Yeah, we leave tomorrow morning to go and to the next island. To the next island. Yeah, and Jaden has decided to depart. She decided she does not want to do an ocean crossing. We did the four day crossing, and I think she decided that was uh, enough of ocean crossing. It's definitely not for everyone. It gets very boring. It can get lonely sometimes. And um, so she, we have another week or so with her and then she's gonna move on to Switzerland. I don't know what it is about our boat and people wanting to go to Switzerland after they get off our boat, but she's gonna go spend some time there and then be with her family for Christmas. Oh wait, show me. Beautiful. Hello, uh, do you speak English? Uh, can I get a pickup, Levantar, at Rubicon Marina? Marina Rubicon, it's not Tirana. Marina Rubicon, see? Uh, tres personas, okay. tres okay. personas, thank you. <laughs> okay, gracias. Gracias. Okay, she's up, so I guess she's coming. <laughs> tres personas. Three people. You couldn't have said that whiter. So today is Tuesday the 21st, Thanksgiving's coming up. Yay! Happy Thanksgiving! We're gonna run to the store and try to find some stuff to make uh, pumpkin pie with. Ooh, pumpkin and then I saw those cobblers. Oh so yeah, that sounds good. That. And then definitely mashed potatoes. I can make pumpkin bread <gasps> if we can't find like crust. Can you make I that? Can make um, everything else. The potato marshmallow casserole. Sweet potato casserole. Sweet potato casserole. I'd have to find sweet potatoes and marshmallows. Oh, and if we have brown sugar, I don't know. You're asking a lot. That is a lot. In a foreign country on Thanksgiving. I mean, we're not even gonna have turkey. We're probably gonna have chicken fried steak. <laughs> I like chicken fried steak Hey, we're from Texas. Go us. Except Yay. for not her. She's I like chicken fried Texas. steak over turkey in almost any day. Really? It's really good. Yeah, it it's, is good. That is lame. Nice. Did you never turkey. To stuff the turkey? No, Did you never know. take your hand and stick it up the turkey? I've never hey. stuffed the turkey. Stuff it. They just got fuel, headed back out to Anchorage, and we are still waiting for our taxi. Do, 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 do. <laughs> okay, so we waited like 30 minutes for the taxi and never showed up. So we're walking now. Now we walk. And now we walk. Can we do baking stuff? I'm sure they have refried beans. You have to get at least one can every Oh my month. goodness, yeah. Super Tex Mex, Texicana. It's chili con carne. Looks good though. Condensed milk. Absolutely. For Should pumpkin get pie. Two yeah. For two pies. Oh, two pies. Two whole pies. Dose. Now pies. we need shortening. Okay, Crisco. Now we need. Uh, maybe it's with the oil, olive oil and stuff. Maybe. Eggs. Eggs. That's pretty, uh, that's pretty good for now. So we have to carry all the stuff back. It's gonna be heavy. We did it! We got nice. groceries. May or may not be able to make a pumpkin pie. You may or may not be able to? There was not any uh what shortening. Mm. Our shortening is pretty old. And uh there were no pie crusts. There were no pie pie, pie crusts, pans. yeah, pie pans, so we're gonna have to make them in uh my make oven it, pan. We can make pumpkin bread, worst case. Back in the sugar scoop. What are you fixing today? I'm putting a temporary mount for the water filtration system. What, for is, what short, is the water filtration? For short water when we're in a marina. Because marina water is nasty. Anyway, while we're at anchor, we use our water maker, which makes excellent water. Yes. But when we're in a marina, marina water is gross. And so we have these little filtration systems. Where did that, where'd you get that from? What? That whole system. I bought it in Turkey. Oh. I think Turkey. But it's in English. Oh, anyway, okay. Hey, 
and you're gonna be able to hang from it, and you're gonna be like, oh my god. Alright, show us what you got, Jaden. Can't, no, that's cheating. Oh. She's cheating. I don't know, it looks difficult. What <laughs> it's not, what she's doing is easy. I can't do one. Grabbing, it's grabbing the wood. So Jaden is leaving us soon. I'm leaving soon. Why? I decided on the crossing that was like four days that I don't love crossings. I live on a boat, you know, but <laughs> We don't do a ton of long passages, and I just wanted, I like boat life because of the water. Get out of here, Finn. What are you doing? <laughs> I like boat life because of the water and the places we get to go to, not so much the sitting on a boat board aspect of it. Yeah. So I thought, why not go home, have Christmas with my family, but before that, go travel Europe by myself, kind of. Yeah. So That's I'm really so sad to be leaving, and I'm really thankful for all the times I've had. But, but you'll, you'll, by the time you leave, you'll have been with us for like two and a half months. Yeah, and who knows? Maybe I'll see you again. Maybe we'll be over there and we'll see you and yeah. cruise with your family. Yeah. Maybe. I'm coming. Okay, me and Keith are going to go try to find a pan. I found a home goods store that might have a pan for our pie. Step, 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 and move. Yeah. Yay, we found the pans. Pie pans. So we decided we're gonna go sail a couple hours over to this other island and we're gonna try to do it without using the motor. Oh, so we're gonna sail? Yeah, Ooh, that's what, what we're gonna that? do. Ooh. You're gonna find out. <laughs> like motorboating on this boat. <laughs> Lori said, if she wants to go to a place where there's a better beach, maybe y'all could have a fire and play spike ball. <laughs> Tempted. Nah, I hate sailing. See, he's a real sailor, guys. Nah. Stop giving him a hard time. Yeah, it's not just the motor. Oh, four knots! Oh, oh you yeah, pure yeah, sailors! Nuts. You purest guys out there. Oh, you're loving this. Nuts. Let's say we'll be there tomorrow. Be there sometime <laughs> tomorrow. Water, so we got. I'm gonna take a hot shower here. There in a you go. That's always good. An exciting new collaboration is coming soon. Stay tuned. regulators for my new Belmar alternators, accessory alternators, They're the ones that charge the main battery bank. Anyway, the one went out over there and so I'm just going to upgrade them all. And in order to truly get efficiency out of both alternators, you need a what they call this uh, central center filter. And it basically takes the electricity from one, slaves it to the other so you get maximum output out of both alternators if you've got both engines running charging the house battery banks. Whereas before, one alternator was always fighting against the alternator for which one needed the more was putting out more juice so neither alternator put out max juice so I'm mounting these inside the door down here because I got to run a wire from here down to the new alternator and then I got to run wires from and these all get wired together and then I got to run a wire from this up to the helm station to the starter switch and to the there's a light up there a red light that tells you when they're not charging getting it all pre-wired ready to go here so all I gotta do is run a line down to the engine on each side two wires to the engine and I gotta run uh, uh, 
these wires down to the battery bank and, and then four wires up to the ignition panel. This is her very last question of high school. This is it. This is the last one. Oh, I have to transfer this. Oh, I can't throw this so on you, Chat GPT. No, no way. Uh, and I'll use Google. Make it I'll use better. Google. No way. Or 11 and 10. Yeah, we didn't cover those. Okay, cool. Yay. That's it. Yeah. She's graduated. She's finished. Yay. At 16. No more school. Yay. And I barely know how to. You know tons of stuff. I don't know. What? Uh, uh, <laughs> that's. Uh, that's Nice. So Kate is finished with homeschool and I am finished being a homeschool mom officially. Yay! I'm gonna get on the floor real quick, see if I can see it. And where do you need to go with it? Yeah, that's gonna be right there, that door. Just Yeah, pull a little more. Just just sit here. That'll be enough, yeah. That's gonna be the ignition wire. I got the thing wired where I wanted it. I ran wires up to the helm station. Yeah. To the starter and the, the lamp, the lights up there. And so now I'm ready to start the wiring process from that panel down to the alternators and install the alternators. You gonna do that today? No. Oh. Okay. Just Stay tuned. I just had enough motivation to do what I just did. And then I ran out of motivation. <laughs> That's happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Yeah. It's that time. Is it that time? It's that time of year. It's beginning to look a lot like Thanksgiving. Lori has been making pumpkin pies all morning. It said if I can pull them out. Oh yeah, if I can pull it out an inch away from the crust clean, yeah. we're good to Gucci. Today for Thanksgiving we are having, um, it's not chicken fried steak, I know I said that. It's chicken fried chicken, mashed potatoes, bread, Carbs, sugar, carbs. Maybe I'll throw dairy. salad in there just for good measure. Um, but holidays on a boat are kind of difficult. Go I got no. I need to go one more. You three. said three bar. Kate is getting in the water on Thanksgiving Day. How odd is that? Keith is over there diving around, playing. Jaden swimming. So yeah, we're losing Miss Jaden in a few weeks, which is unfortunate. But we do have another person showing up in a few weeks i don't want to say who it is yet because if something happens and he doesn't come then that'll be really sad so if he does come he's bringing a bunch of christmas gifts that we have planned for our kids because we will be on the ocean crossing on christmas so we can all celebrate christmas together and make it kind of traditional uh probably have a good meal but holidays on a boat are really tricky because you can't always find the ingredients you want like the thing with our pie crust and pans and um, so you kind of get what you get and you don't throw a fit. So today we're gonna eat good. We're gonna have chicken fried, it's not chicken fried steak, it's chicken fried chicken. But mashed potatoes and gravy and some yummy stuff and pumpkin pies. And just be thankful, sit around and probably not watch football. That's what we would do if we were in Dallas. We'd watch uh, the Cowboys or actually the Denver Broncos. We're more of uh, Denver Bronco fans, sorry. So we might try to stream some football today. We'll see. Anyway, Kate's gonna go down and scrub the hole for a little bit and let's see how that works out. Is a bit, the inside is really clean, but the outside is a bit dirty. Yeah. Yeah, the, the water sun. line is super dirty. Yeah. yeah, the water line's pretty bad. How's the copper coat look? Looks good, really good. Yeah. Pulling up. All right, Kate's peeling taters for the mashed potatoes. It's fixing to be on. Take your appetite, do not you dare. Right. Happy Thanksgiving! Happy no. Thanksgiving! Right. I am thankful for each and every one of you here. I'm no, thankful. We're not thankful. Yes. Those chickens look a little dark. Shall I overcook? No. Oh, they're crispy no. and perfect. No. 